just a question or just a clarification on going back to the pristine soul. Yes. I'm a bit confused as to whether the pristine soul is in a six-sphere state or a 22nd-sphere state. Well, you, it, you would that. say that it's in a six-sphere state, yeah. but it's in, uh, in terms of the first time you can actually view it. it you have to be in a 22nd-sphere condition to see yeah. it. The distinction because I the only way to see the soul is in that unified yeah. state. But I understand you're saying because they're in a, in a unified state, yeah. The, yeah. Differential, the differential is, well, there's many, but in the six-sphere state, we're perfected in natural love. Yeah. So the love yes. that God has the, placed in us, the capacity for love that God has placed in us for other people. In the 22nd sphere state, we have recognised, we've fully individuated ourselves, we've recognised God, we've longed to God for love, mm. and we've received that personally, mm. and we've also dealt with all of the injuries that we, were created through our incarnation mm. that blocked us to our soulmate, yeah. and we've reached union in a conscious way. Yeah, so you're totally in aware. This, yes, yeah. you're yeah. not aware yeah. even... These are not conscious of their own uh -huh. union. So yeah. they're not conscious yes. of themselves, they're not conscious that I'm half of a soul. As, as we're all finding out, this is things <laughs> we discover <laughs> after incarnation. Yeah. And um, the only similarity is that they are unified, but that's mm. just because God creates them creates all of us mm -hmm. in this unified mm -hmm. state. Yeah. So you could say that that is the real self, the complete, yeah. yes. you know, so the two halves unified mm -hmm. is the complete self. Not mm -hmm. So at the moment you are just one half yes, of yes. your complete self, but you are one half of your complete self that is slowly gaining awareness and one of the awarenesses you're gaining is there, it's this awareness that there is the other half sure, out yes. there of yourself yes. somewhere. Right? And that's one of the awarenesses through this process of individualization. That's one of the awarenesses that we eventually gain, that we actually have the other half of us somewhere. Yeah. Yeah. Now, for many people who are on the earth, they don't have that awareness. And this is one of the things we, we want to talk about with sexual attraction. But secondly, most spirits don't have that awareness until they reach the fifth sphere or the fifth dimension in the spirit world that's when they begin gaining a much greater awareness that there is the other half of themselves does that make sense so that's generally what happens now on earth we can gain that awareness at a very very early stage if we desire to but the problem is historically is the awareness hasn't been present and so the majority of us don't really understand what's going on with regard to soulmate attraction yep yep if we Put Just the 